Hey guys, Harvey Dude's the name, and today I am back with another Redstone Contraption Showcase or tutorial, both in one video, on how to make a block system using a key in Minecraft. So, you know, I'm going to use uh, piston doors. This is where the door is. So, yeah, let's get to it. So, place key in the hopper, okay? Uh, that's not the key. This is not power, it just leaves that block in there. But if I do grab the real key, it will not be in there, and I will be able to uh, walk through the door. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. If you did come up with this before me without me knowing, because I didn't look up any tutorials on how to make this, if you did make this before me and made a video on it, uh, tell me in the description, or tell me in the comments, actually. You can't go in the description and type anything. And just... Tell me that you made it, tell me where to find it on your channel, and I'll put it as the original video. So, I only have one original video, so the first person to tell me, and I find that they're not lying, they will be in the description as the original video. So, then I got extra iron storage right here. And, yeah, this is just a little quick overview of the redstone. Like, I'm not going to say anything, because I'm going to go over all of it when I do the tutorial and I'm gonna go through some of it on my stripped down version over here so over here I got the stripped down version so for this one I'm using lapis lazuli so it is completely customizable you don't have to use iron or lapis lazuli you could use like block of emeralds you could use gray wool those are just in my inventory because they were I don't know why they are maybe maybe I had the gray wool from over there or something like when I was making the wheels <laughs> that was a while ago wow I got some really old wool but anyway sorry for the sidetrack but so what's going on right here is I got exactly 22 of the block for my key in here and what's that what that does is that powers this comparator enough to power this redstone dust right here but not enough to power this piece of redstone because if that was powered that would power this repeater which would blink this uh, redstone torch on and off and what that would do it would be able to uh, make this hopper move the item that's in it into this chest and then we also got redstone wiring over here that would power this hopper to move it into here which, where I got a whole lot of storage so well a whole, whole lot of the block not a whole lot of storage just yeah <laughs> So, if I put just a normal block, not the real thing in, it will just stay in there, because this is full. It won't allow anything but the block it has in it to go through it. And the reason I have this extra half here is so that no bypasser could just walk over and be like, Oh, look, that's the thing. I just... Yeah, that's why I have it there. It's just for more security. So... And then it also, you can just go and grab it. So, grab the key that you thought was it, but it wasn't. So, and then if I do put the correct uh, block in it, I'll just, uh, oops, come on, where are you? There you go. If I do put the correct block, it will blink everything <laughs> very fastly, and then I have some delays over here that power this door with an inverter also. So, now I'm going to get to the tutorial on how to make this thing. So what you're going to need, I have all the items in my hop bar that you need. So you need four hoppers, two redstone comparators, a various amount of repeaters, just make sure it is uh, enough to power this thing and also this. And, you know, yeah, just make sure it works. But this is that's com customizable. Two redstone torches, I have one redstone torch for the inverter, but that is optional also. But you need this one right here. So I guess this could be a uh, various amounts too. A various amount of redstone. Just make sure you got everything here and uh, that one right there. Or else it won't work. A building block. I'm just using sandstone. A sticky piston or piston or redstone lamp or whatever you're going to use to power your... Uh, little redstone contraption thingy-mabobber. Well, not to power, like, what you're powering. So, and then you're gonna need two chests. I only got one chest in here for some reason, but whatever. You need two chests. One for, uh, just traveling through this thing, and then one for storage. 
and then a block like um, your key, not not a block of iron. It could be like a block of iron. <laughs> I just randomly put pick that, but it could be anything. It doesn't matter. Just don't use a block of redstone because that'll mess it up. Because you can make clocks with that. So you know you, you don't want to use that. So let's get to the tutorial. So now what you're gonna need is you're gonna need to make a little diamond thingy. Like this. Here, let's uh, actually move this over a little bit so I don't get things screwed up. You just need to make a diamond, just like this. It looks like a diamond. So you need to make this first. Next, and then you're gonna put a block either on either side, either on the top right or top left. I'm just gonna use top left. And now you're going to need to put one of your comparators there it doesn't ma matter if it's in subtraction mode or comparing mode then redstone dust going down like that a repeater in the middle facing this way and then a redstone torch so now you have this little circuit that will blink this thing once powered now you're going to need to put a hopper right there feeding into this comparator another hopper up here to place your item in and you're gonna need to put a chest right here just make it floating like it's minding its own business uh, is it getting dark oh yeah and a little glitch is like I can't see the sun any but you'll need your chest here and then a hopper feeding into that so it should look like this with the little comparator on the little bump I guess you could say the threadstone going down the repeater right there facing this way and the redstone torch so what this redstone torch is gonna do is it's gonna power this hopper but we're not there yet now we're gonna have to use our key that we want to use and we're gonna have to put exactly 22 in here so and then that's 22 right there so it could be like two fives and three fours just make sure it adds up to 22 and that that made it darker um, <laughs> So, now that you've got that, now we're going to put a, another hopper here. Make sure to shift click or else you're just going to keep on doing this. And that's not, you don't want to do that. And then we're going to put a, another chest right there. So you've got this little thingy right here. So you got the three uh, uh, hoppers, one going down, one going right, and one going left. With the comparator feeding, like with this hopper feeding into this comparator which powers this redstone trail and with this redstone repeater in the middle and the redstone torch and then these two things sort of stacked with chest hopper chest so now we're going to put a redstone trail going this way and we're going to have a little staircase going up and that and this redstone trail is going to power oops this hopper right here so it can move into the storage chest. So if I test this out, I did use iron. First, it'll get stuck right here, that's good. Next, one will get stuck right here, and that is good. And now, one will finally go into this chest. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. So you need uh, blocks staying in these two, these last two hoppers for the thing to work. So, you know, you can sort of see it pulsing, you can see the Oops. You can see the redstone torch go off and on. And, yeah, so next we're going to shift-click and put a block on the other side of the hopper. And we're going to put a comparator in, on there. So for that little tenth of a second or how long it's for the really short while that that block, that's your key, is in this chest, the uh, comparator will get that power from the block. So we're going to put redstone feeding from the comparator a repeater and a another piece of redstone and a trail going down or up or wherever you want your contraption to be so <laughs> now we're going to put a comparator here on vortex delay and we're going to put the inverter here also just for the door just because i'm using the door it doesn't really matter i'm so, and then we're going to put just a piston here. And it could be like four pistons or how many pistons you want, but I'm just going to use one. <laughs> so now we have this whole thingy made. So if we test it out, it should work. 
Yes, it does. And as you can see, it goes down and up. So, I'll just do another overview of what you have to do. You have to have your three hoppers going down like this, one going down, one right, and left. Your little diamond with the little bump on the left or right. I'm using left. The comparator with the trail going down to here, with the repeater in the middle, and the redstone torch. The trail going up to this hopper right here, and these two chests on above and below that hopper. The comparator feeding into that top chest with the repeater going down, and that you need to have this repeater here. And then you yeah, got your inverter, and you got this thing that you're powering. So, yeah. It's pretty cool. I couldn't figure out how to make the, uh, I don't know if I said this before, I think I might have, but I don't think, I didn't figure out how to make the piston or whatever you're using, like, stay down longer. So, you know, if you know how to fix that and made this and figured out a way, tell me in the comments, and that would be much appreciated. And, yeah, that's basically the tutorial. So, Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of a Redstone Tutorial thingy Mabapper. If you did, be sure to uh, like and comment on maybe what I should do for Redstone and stuff like that, you know. And if you did make this before me, be sure to comment on that also. And, you know, be sure to subscribe also because I, I just reached 30 subscribers and I want to thank everybody that has been sticking with me through this adventure that I'm having in YouTube, <laughs> in this mysterious place called YouTube. So, yeah, and do all the other stuff that YouTubers do, and I'll see you guys in another episode. Peace.